Hi there guys, got a cool tweak for you today, it's called Touch Power Keyboard. It's been updated now for iOS 7. I'll just head to Notes and show it to you. So if I do a new note, up pops my keyboard. Now this is the Touch Power Keyboard. And it enables you to swipe your words like this. So I'll just put in this is the Touch Power Keyboard. So it's a good swipe like keyboard. You can swipe down on the C there to put in a period. Uh, one thing I don't like after a, after you've done a period for, or a full stop, uh, your next word does not auto capitalize, like so, which is a little bit annoying. You can hit the shift key and hit space, and it will capitalize it for you. Or also, you could hit that shift key first and get the first letter capitalized. But that's a little bit of a bit of a pain. But pretty much the only thing I found bad about this is accuracy is really good. Uh, you can teach it new words. So, for example, it's not going to work. Know the word. Um, let's put Dorking, a town near me. So we'll just teach it hit by typing in like this. So once you typed it in, it comes up there. You can tap on it. And then the next time you type it with a swipe, it will remember Dorking, like so. So to get this, you need to head over to Cydia. Uh, in Cydia, you need to go to Search. And you need to search for Touch Power. It's not going to come up in the suggestions you need to hit the search button before it comes up. Now that's because it has these Chinese characters just before it, as you can see here. But you hit on that. So it's this package you need, Touch Power Keyboard. The author is Qtech. And you need to install this. It's got a load of Chinese text. It's, uh, it claims it's a Chinese input method, and it does that as well. But uh, it's just the, uh, the swipe-like abilities we're after. So once you've installed it, it allows you to reboot your device. And then you head over to Settings. Go into General, go into Keyboard, and then go into Keyboards. Use the option to add new keyboard, and scroll down to TouchPal, and it will have added a few new keyboards for you. And you want the TouchPal ENG one. Uh, it's not showing up here because I already have it installed just here, as you can see. And then it gives you the ability anywhere where you can use a keyboard. So let's just go into Safari, for example. Okay. And you bring it up. Obviously, you can scroll through your different keyboards using the globe. Like so, my emoji keyboard, my regular keyboard, and there's my touchpad keyboard. And word suggestions are shown at the top. So if we just start typing. So if I didn't want there and I want theirs, you can just select the other word. You can scroll along these for all the different word suggestions that are possible. Or just hit this button to see all the word suggestions on a grid like so. So yeah, it just gives you a, a, a swipe like keyboard anywhere on iOS where uh, a keyboard is present. Thanks a lot for watching.